the next question is how we can build boosters. There are uh, various ways to do that. The most popular ones are utilizing transistors and op-amps. These are the ones I would like to discuss. So the most popular boosters are something like LPB1. This is a very simple common emitter booster. It's super simple. It's a textbook circuit, basically. Also, Range Master, which is basically the same circuit. It's also common emitter circuit, but using PNP transistors, so the polarization is reversed. Main difference between these two is this one capacitor. Look, 5 nanofarads in contrast to 100 nanofarads. What does it do? It cuts all the low end from your guitar. This capacitor here, combined with input impedance of this circuit, which is quite low because of this voltage divider, combined with low gain of this germanium transistor, it gives quite a low input impedance. Everything combined will result with a quite strong I-pass filter, which will cut all the lower end and boost everything above. This is how we do treble boosting. Very simple. Another example, MXR microamp. Very simple circuit as well. It's basically a textbook circuit. We've got a non-inverting uh, op-amp configuration here with a logarithmic pod in here, which sets the gain. And another category could be a FET booster. So using JFET or MOSFET in a common source configuration. Super simple. There are many ways to build a booster.